using our calculator to solve this system of equations. You see there's three unknowns. Uh, these actually represent vector planes, but to solve this in the calculator, we're actually going to use the matrix feature. So go second x to the minus 1, which brings up the uh, matrix catalogs here. And go over to edit by pushing over twice. You can see here that I can now edit A by pushing enter. Uh, it's a 3x3 three three matrix here, but if I include this last column, it's a 3x4. So just check by in 3x4, that's rows by columns, 3 rows, 4 columns. And then we can put in, uh, enter in the coefficients of each of these variables. So 1x, so 1, 3, minus 1. When you're typing in one, minus 1, make sure that you don't type in uh, minus 1. You need to push the negative button. And then over here, you see that the last column is 15, 7, 0. All right, so then go quit. You can see here, go second matrix again, go over to math, push up, and we need to go to B here, RREF, push enter. RREF stands for row reduction echelon form. Go to second matrix one more time, last time, and just select A by pushing enter. So RREF A, uh, matrix A, push enter, and you can see here, this is our answer. So what this means is that 1x plus 0y plus 0z equals 2, which means x equals 2. 0x plus 1y plus 0z equals 4, so y equals 4. And 0x plus 0y plus 1z equals negative 1. So 1z or z equals negative 1, which means these three vector planes all intersect in one point at one point. Hope that helps.